Now we're going to begin practicing variations of Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. Bow to teacher. Now get your bow ready. Just as we always hold it. One, two. Get the tip in position. That's right. Get your feet set. One, two. All right. Next, hold the violin by yourself. Take it like this with your hand out in front. Now turn it over and rest it on your shoulder. Can you hold it there even without your hand? Now this time, be sure your left shoulder doesn't move from its position out front. Let's try just the rhythm a little. When we play the E string, let's have the bow pointing straight up. Next, let's change to the A string. When you make this string change, change the angle of the bow by moving your hand first, gently. Leave your elbow as it is. Try playing the A string now. You did that very well. Next, practice playing the A string and E string. Ready? First, the A string. Playing the E string, your hand may want to come around back. So to prevent that, be careful to keep your elbow in the proper position. Now lift up the bow, and we'll practice pressing down our fingers in the right places. Yoko-chan, let me have the violin for a minute. We've marked with tape the correct places where your fingers should press the strings. Okay, press down correctly. One, two. Plucking the strings in pizzicato, let's check whether we are pressing the right places or not. When you release all your fingers, don't open up your hand like this. Keep your fingers curled. All right now, Yoko-chan, let's try the variation of Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. Let's practice the notes one at a time, stopping in between. Go ahead and try it. One, two, three. After you've pressed your finger down correctly, then change strings. is a little wrong, so the sound is too low. Now, lifting all your fingers, let's go back to the beginning. was fine. The reason we stop between each phrase like this is so that we have time while we are stopped to get all set to play the next note. Now, Yoko-chan, press your fingers down correctly. One, two, three. And then play taka taka ta ta. This time, while I'm saying ton, quickly release the previous finger. 
Press the next finger down and be sure it's in the correct position. And check if your bow has changed properly to the string you want to play this time. We must get all these things right between notes. This is one of the important techniques of playing that Dr. Suzuki has devised. He always tells you one fingers, two bow, three start. He teaches you to set the base for your playing in that order. You did very well, Yoko-chan. Okay, we'll end our lesson here. The first step is to build correct posture. Next, we practice the notes of a piece one by one, stopping in between. Then, after we've mastered all five of the different rhythms for our variations on Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, then, and only then, we start practicing playing the piece all the way through. Naoko-chan is now going to play the variations on Twinkle Twinkle Little Star with piano accompaniment in this way. All right, get ready. And set the violin snugly against your neck. Now do our one, two, three, and get the bow in place properly. That's right, have it on the E string, then change to the A string.
That was fine. Well, now we can say at last that you can indeed play Twinkle Twinkle Little Star.